Before using baby bottles, it's very important for moms to make sure it's sterilized. In this video, we will talk about the different ways to sterilize your baby's bottle. But before we proceed, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. The material in this video is provided solely for educational reasons and is not intended as medical advice. Let's get started! Steam Steam sterilizers for baby feeding equipment are available from a variety of manufacturers. The procedure employs heat to eliminate hazardous microorganisms similar to boiling. This option is appropriate for parents who live in city apartments and don't use gas stoves. Electric baby bottle sterilizers are probably the quickest and easiest alternative if you want or need to sanitize bottles frequently despite being a little more expensive than any of the other options. Simply follow the manufacturer's direction to the letter. They can also be used to disinfect bottles, bottle components, nipples, and other items. Once the infant has outgrown the bottle stage, many women use these for small plastic toys and teeth and rings. Now that's what I'm talking about when it comes to stretching a dollar. So hurry mom and dad, get your own steam sterilizer now! Boiling Water the most frequent method of sterilizing used all around the world is boiling infant bottles. It's also the simplest approach and you can keep breast milk or even formula in a bottle this way. However, you must first clean the bottle. All you need is water and a pot to sanitize baby bottles with boiling water. It's also okay to use this procedure to disinfect plastic bottles. Here's how to do it. Rinse the bottles, lids, and nipples you're going to sterilize thoroughly with clean water after cleaning them with regular dishwashing soap. Place them in a big saucepan with enough water to completely submerge all of the equipment. There should be no air bubbles in it. Bring the water to a fast boil and hold it there for 5 minutes. Turn off the gas and let the water cool down on its own. If you're going to feed right away, wash your hands and the kitchen surface where you'll prepare the bottle before taking it out. When wiping the sterilized goods dry, do not use a towel since contaminants will transfer from the cloth to the bottle. To get rid of dripping water, simply shake the container. Microwave Microwaving infant bottles to sterilize them saves time. Microwave sterilizers use steam to sterilize baby bottles, teats, and feeding accessories by heating water to create steam. They're small and compact and they sterilize quickly usually in other 6 minutes. They're also better for traveling than electric steam sterilizers because they're more portable. Here's how to do it. Begin with a spotless microwave. Half fill the bottles with water. Microwave for 1-2 to two minutes on high. Remove the bottles from the microwave using oven mitts. Drain any remaining water and air dry. UV Sterilizer The UV Sterilizer is a device that uses ultraviolet light to kill bacteria. It makes steam appear antiquated and the cold water approach appear medieval. Despite the fact that technology has been present since 1878. However, they've only recently gained popularity in households as a simple, water-free solution to sterilize infant bottles. UV light kills bacteria by breaking down their molecular structure rather than requiring heat to kill them. There is no need to add water, which means no steam or hot water burns, no leaks, and most importantly, no descaling. Or to put it another way, there is no remorse for not descaling. Unlike steam sterilizers which are frequently very hot to the touch, bottles can be taken out and used right away. Here is how you can do it. You put your bottles in and after they've been washed. The only little complication is ensuring that everything is disassembled and nothing is in contact. This is due to the fact that UV light cannot travel through most materials. To sterilize it, it must reach every surface. Place it in the sterilizer. Press the start button. Bleach As a last option, it is recommended to sterilize baby's bottle with bleach if you can't boil, steam, or use a dishwasher to do it. Bleach is an extremely effective technique to sterilize just about anything, and it produces a spotless result. Are you afraid to use it on your baby's bottles? Don't be! When you can't boil, steam, or use the dishwasher, 
This procedure is advised, claiming that any bleach left on the bottles after the sterilization process will break down quickly as it dries and will not harm your baby. Here's how to do it. Mix 1 to 2 tablespoons of unscented bleach with 16 cups of water in a clean wash basin. Dismantle the bottles. Completely submerge all the section of the bottles. Make sure the solution is evenly distributed throughout the bottles and that there are no air bubbles in the bottoms. Allow 2 to 5 minutes for the bottles and pieces to soak. Tongs are used to remove the bottle pieces. Rinse to avoid reintroducing germs to the bottles. Allow the bottles to dry naturally on a clean cloth. The bleach will break down as the bottles dry and will not harm the infant. This is comparable to the bleaching used to sanitize restaurant dishes. Dishwasher A separate sanitizing step is not necessary if you use a dishwasher with hot water and a heating drying cycle or sanitizing setting to clean infant feeding items. In other words, pop your baby's dishwasher safe bottles in your trusty kitchen helper and they'll emerge washed, sterilized, and ready to meet the needs of your hungry baby. The procedure is as follows. Rinse the bottles that have been used. Place rinsed bottles in the dishwasher and set the temperature to hot water wash and heat or sanitize dry. You're done once you press the start button. The bottles will be ready to use after the dishwasher has finished its work. How about you? How do you keep your baby bottle sterilized? Please tell us in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.